Happy Saturday, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com doing some baseball. 2017 Triple Threads Baseball, nine box inner. Pick your team number 11 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Big thanks to... It's from a fresh master case, too. Big thanks to these folks for getting into the action on a Saturday night. Nice. Thanks to everybody for getting in. Mark got the last four teams and the last spot mojo in the Texas Rangers. Let's open up this case first, and we'll see which inner we're going to do. We're also watching. Uh, I'm also watching the Dodger game, so if you see me get distracted at some point, it's going to be because of that. We've got a TV right over there here at the shop. All right, so we're going to roll the die, or kind of throw the die into this box here. And one, two, three will be the top box, and four, five, six will be the bottom box. Using this uh, nice Bellagio die right here. All right, and it's four. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this is the case we'll be doing right here. I will mark this PYT uh, 12. Mark that PYT 12, and that'll be for next time. That's already in the store, jazbeeshobbyland.com. So if you want to get a head start on that, we can definitely do that. Maybe try to do the whole master case tonight. Here we go. X marks the spot right here. My little paper stand. Okay. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. Big fan of the triple threads. Glad we've been filling this up lately. It was a little quiet on the triple threads front for a little while, but got some momentum again. Now we've been seeing two case hits per inner box, so that's that's what we should be looking forward to in this one. All right, good luck, boys and girls. Good luck, everyone. Thank you, thank you, thank you for getting into this triple threads. One of my favorite baseball products released year to year. Now, I'm not sure what we're going to do after this. How are we doing on time? We should be able to finish this break by the top of the hour, no matter where you are in the world. It should be, we should be able to fill this at the top of the hour. And after that, I don't see any ores coming in at the moment. And I don't know what is necessarily close at the moment. But I'm sure we could rally around something because by the time we get to the top of the hour, we'll have about three solid hours left in the broadcast. And then we'll see what we can do from there. We'll be eating a little bit of dinner after this break, too. We'll be taking a break after the break. And then we'll break some more. All right. There's the babe. 23 out of 99. Babe Ruth. Bronx Bombers. That'll go to Carlos, Mr. LT. Pedro Martinez. 122 out of 250 for the Red Sox. Carlos with the Bo Sox as well. He's got a lot of teams in this one. Nice. Thank you, Carlos. Some base cards. Giancarlo Stanton. Daniel Murphy. And Smoltzy, beyond Smoltzy is Adam Jones. 7 out of 27, World Baseball Classic Triple Relic. That'll go to the Orioles, of course, Jesse. And behind Smoltz is Royals, Alex Gordon. 15 out of 75, Jersey and Autograph, Carlos with KC. Ryan Braun to 340. Brew Crew. Julio Urias, 71 out of 150. Safe? Nice. For the Dodgers, that'll go to Chad. George Springer. Adrian Beltre. And behind Francisco Lindor is Derek Jeter. Wow, five out of eight this is the first Derek Jeter I've seen. The captain himself, triple relic, autograph, five out of 18. Wow, just a few off the jersey number, of course. 
That goes to the Bronx Bombers. That goes to Carlos. Mr. LT. What a hit. <laughs> wow. I've, of all the cases we've done, I've maybe seen one Aaron Judge and this the first Derek Jeter. That's amazing. Then there's Xander Bogarts, 24 out of 27. Wow, nice one, Mr. LT. That is strong. That was just the first box. <laughs> that was just the first box. Ziggy, what's going on? That's right, scared money don't make money, Ziggy. Pretty sick hit for Carlos. Congrats again. We got Roberto Clemente to 340. We'll sleeve these now. We'll top load all these later. We've got Ozzy Smith, the Wizard, to 50. Robinson Cano, Addison Russell. Now there's Clayton Kershaw. And King Kenta. Kenta Maeda, two out of three, triple relic. And autograph. Nice. Who is who has found new life on the Dodgers currently as a relief pitcher. Pitched two innings, four strikeouts. And usually he throws about low to mid nineties fastballs if he's starting. He was he was ratcheting up those fastballs to like 95, 96. And he was fired up too. That's a nice hit. Two out of three for Chad. All aboard. The Big Hit Express. Woo woo! And we've got some Bryce Harper back here. Six out of 36. Nationals out to go to Mike Koontz. That's his month right here, Reggie Jackson. This is his month. Goes to the Bronx Bombers. Corey Seager, not on the NLCS roster. Out of 340, bad back. Tweaked it and was just, wasn't just going to be ready in time. So, Chad with the Dodgers. Albert Pools, Buster Posey. There's Goldie. And there's Mookie. 22 out of 36. Two-color triple relic for the Bo Sox. Carlos with that one. That's right, YOLO. Go Dodgers. And behind Goldschmidt is a Cub, Javier Baez. This is who my Dodgers are facing. It's going to be a tough series. One out of ten. Jersey Auto, Javier Baez. Carlos with the Cubs. Nice. Nice hits. All right. There's Todd. Let's go Cubbies, he said. We, we, we've been scratching back, Todd. We've been scratching back. All right. Next two mini boxes. Good luck. Start off with Jackie Robinson, 49 out of 150. Just a handful off that jersey number, Chad. There's Julio Urias again, 143 out of 250. We should see him next year back in action after that shoulder issue, surgery. Uh, Rocket, Rizzo, 
got Crush Davis right here. And we've got Ryan Healy. Nice. Triple Relic and Autograph. On card auto. 28 out of 50. He's had a solid season. Solid rookie season for him. I believe that's his Futures game jersey right here when it, when it was in uh, San Diego. Hence the San Diego colors. Oakland A's. That'll be for Carlos. Behind Chris Davis is David Wright. One out of 18. That's a relic for the Metropolitans of the Bill with the Mets. The Redbirds, Ledmies Diaz at a 250. Hi, you can leave that right there. Okay. Thank you. Bye -bye. Max Scherzer to 340. Nationals, that goes to Mike Koontz. We've got Mookie Betts, Eric Hosmer. Do the Royals keep Eric Hosmer? There's a young-looking Mark McGuire revealing a Joey Votto, Votto-matic. 22 out of 27 for the Red Legs. That is one for Mr. LT, Carlos. See? Young-looking Mark McGuire and Herman Marquez. Nice one for the Rockies. 43 out of 99. So that's the first third of the case. That Rockies auto will go to Ryan Redman. Nice, Ryan. Oh, speaking of Kenta Maeda, he, he's been pitching already. He's been in relief already. They might be taking him out. Yeah, so he logged in an inning. Uh, made five pitches, got three outs. So, good for him. That's what he needed to do as a reliever. He's been pretty great. It's like we got a redemption in here. Any guesses on the redemption? Get bragging rights if you get it right. Out of 340, Xander Bogarts, Bo Sox. Definitely glad the Dodgers have this guy on, on our team. 16 out of 25, Hugh Darvish. That'll still go to the Rangers, though. That's Rangers edition. Mark Bear with that. Barry Larkin, Sandy Koufax. And behind Max Scherzer is three little birds. Six out of 18, Adam Jones. Manny Machado, Chris Davis. This trio of Orioles will go to Jesse. All right. Another DECA book, ESPN Kids Guessing. There's Adam Duvall, Jersey and Auto, 45 out of 50 for the Reds. Carlos. All right, there's Ty Cobb for the Tigers out of 340. That's for Josh York. Felix Hernandez out of 150. That goes to the Mariners, Carlos. Got Gary Sanchez, Starley Marte. There's Javier Baez. Let's show off the relic first. Byron Buxton, 25 out of 27. Piece of the lumber, nice. Uh, Carlos with the Twins, Mr. LT. All right, the redemption, Javier Baez. Behind Javier Baez is Triple Threads Autograph Relic Card of C A I don't know R. Carlos Correa? Carlos Correa, nice one for the Strohs. Carlos for Mr. LT. Carlos, Carlos to Carlos.
Nice. All right, next box. Oh, another redemption. Any guesses on that? Mark McGuire, 3 out of 25. For the A's, that'll go to Carlos. We've got Byron Buxton again out of 250. Another one for Mr. LT and the Twins. Got Mike Trout. Freddie Freeman. Adam Jones reveals a Dodger. Andrew Tolles. Triple relic and autograph. 17 out of 99. Andrew Tolles was on track to be to have like some sort of breakout season, but big knee injury cost of their season early on. All right, and behind Adam Jones is another Dodger. Adrian Gonzalez, piece of his lumber. 14 out of 36. That goes to Chad and the Dodgers. Francisco Lindor to 250. Indians. Jeff. Out of 250, Jacob DeGrom for the Metropolitans. That's for Nabil. Justin Verlander, Johnny Bench, Mookie Betts, Triple Relic, 17 out of 18, Red Sox, that'll be for Mr. LT, and the Redemptions, no guesses for the Redemptions, no one wants to guess, well, it's Triple Threads Unity Autograph, Jumbo Relic, G, R, E, Greg, Greg Bird? Put a bird on it. Greg Bird. Carlos with the Yankees. Nice. Next box. Uh, the second half of this master case, pick your team or pick your team twelve. This is pick your team eleven. Pick your team twelve is in the store already. JaspiesHobbyland.com. So if you want to get a head start on some teams, go for it. Um, after this break, I'm taking a quick dinner break, enjoy a little bit of that Dodgers game, and then we'll come back, we'll reconvene, and then we'll see what other breaks we could get into. I know absolute football is getting a little bit closer. We could do more of this baseball. We could do more impeccable. We did, we did two cases today. And both cases were pretty hot. We can keep that train moving. I'll just go to jazbeeshobbyland.com. We'll figure something out. All right, there's Kenta Maeda. Another great inning of relief. Brandon Morrow closing out the seventh inning. There's Jeter. Got his autograph earlier. That was nice. Nice Jeter for Mr. LT. This is Reggie's month right there. There's Josh Donaldson. The hit behind Will Myers is... Wow! Jackie Robinson cut auto. What a case. we got that Derek Jeter, the 2 out of 3 Kenta Maeda, and this Jackie Robinson relic and cut auto 1 of 1. Wow! Wow! That is for Chad and the Dodgers. A Dodger Joe Mojo. Next time some kid asks, hey, Joe, what's the best thing you've ever pulled? I suppose we could tell him this is one of the best things I've ever pulled. 
You got the number 42. You got pieces of the lumber. Wow. That is pretty incredible. Chad, <clears throat> it's my pleasure to welcome you all aboard the Big Hit Express. You get to pull the train whistle. It's going to be a nice pull. Jackie Robinson. Chad, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo! What a hit. Man. Old Brooklyn Dodger, Jackie Robinson. Legend for so many reasons. All right, behind Will Myers, Tyler Glass now, two out of 18. That is insane. Uh, Chad, are, I don't know if Chad's even in the room. He bought the Dodgers not too long ago. He might be in the room. There's George Brett, 250 for the Royals. Carlos with that one. At a 340, Manny Machado. I know, Bennett, I, 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 I don't know if I should really just move on with this break. I should just burn the rest of the boxes. It's not going to get any better. <laughs> I already got the Jeter. I already got the 2 out of 3, Kenta Maeda. I got the 1 of 1, Jackie Robinson, Cut Auto. Uh, Matt Carpenter, 3 out of 9. So, yeah, I know. Like, I, I could pull, like, an out of five patch auto of Bryce Harper and we'll all kind of be like, oh, that's good, I guess. <laughs> I'll pull out a Mike Trout auto and be like, okay, that's okay. Uh, I, I mean, I'm, even, I'm distracted now. We got Chris Wilson with the Matt Carpenter, two color triple relic. We got Ray's Corey Dickerson, patch auto, 26 out of 75. Uh, Mr. LT with the Tampa Bay Rays. Yeah, he is being a kid. I mean, there, there's this, 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 this is a piece of his. This is big for everybody, you know. Breaking the color barrier, so much history that's involved in Jackie Robinson. Not only for for, not not only was a good player, but a lot, lot of cultural significance for for America. Well, I can't imagine Kyle. There's very many cut autos in this product in the first place, of that of that caliber, you know. There we go. It's another dinger. Who hit that one? Yasiel? Wow. Yeah, it looks like Yasiel Puig is back. No Corey Seager, no problem. There's Albert Pujols out of 50. Uh, actually, we wouldn't put that in a bag ever, Nino, because in the shipping process, it rattles around too much, and it actually could damage the, the, uh, the edges of the card and the surface. If you sleeve this up, pro tip, folks, if you sleeve this up and you top load it, it doesn't move at all. It doesn't move at all. So that's why, that's why it's, it's safer this way. In a bag, there's enough room for it to rattle around, hurt the edges, hurt the surface. Altuve to 250. Astros. Pedro Martinez, Honus Wagner. So I remember some kid, some uh, some cocky kid called called us out on Twitter uh, when we pulled some other nice thing and was just was just like was just like hey. Uh, you know, you got to put that in a bag, bro. I didn't even bother responding. It was so silly. I was like, you don't know what you're talking about. 3 out of 27, Mookie Betts. Now, for uh, for once you get it and you just want to display it and you're not going to move it, you know, yeah, you can put it in a bag. It just, it just visually looks nicer that way. If you kind of bag it up, you could display it on a mantle or something on your, in your living room or something like that. Yeah, then a bag is fine. All right, uh, that goes to the Red Sox. So does the Ciaz. And Amir Garrett for the Reds. Reds, Red Sox, Carlos has both of those. 25 out of 50. 
Nice Amir Garrett. Right, so yeah, most of you will notice that when you when you get hits from us for uh, for cards that don't quite fit nicely in a top loader, you'll see that we'll put blue painter's tape right there so it holds it shut and uh, cards won't slide out. 51 out of 99. Charlie Culberson? Who needs Corey Seager when you got Charlie Culberson hitting doubles? There's Granky for the Diamondbacks. Ah, there's Jackie Robinson again. 009 out of 250. Very sweet. Max Scherzer, Corey Seager. Yeah, who needs Corey Seager? There's more Jackie Robinson. There's Javier Baez. Nice. Two color patch. Two colors. Triple relic. 83 out of 99. Cubs. That goes to Carlos. Uh, yeah, that is that's that's definitely has to be one of the case hits. Five out of nine, two color. Unless we get lucky and they just give us two more, you know. Yeah, that's my assumption too. That is my assumption as well. So. That might be one of them. We, we still might get a triple relic, triple lotto. If we're lucky, we'll get three. Get a white whale, too. There's Miggy. More Jackie. Nice. I'll take, take those pictures together. All right. Two boxes to go. This has been an incredible case. At the beginning, I thought I was going to clickbait this Derek Jeter autograph, and I still ha still would, but now I get to add one of one Jackie to it as well. All right. Two more master boxes to go. Four more mini boxes to go. Pick your team 11 has been a great one. Felix Hernandez out of 250. Mariners. Corey Kluber to 340, 34 out of 340 for the Indians, Jeff G. Uh, Josh is asking, are, am I informed on how players are paid for their autos? Yes, they're usually paid in in, uh, in, in, in money. In money. Hank Aaron, Don Mattingly. You should get a check from the company. There's Dave Winfield. Wow. 17 out So you got the Jeter and the Dave Winfield, Mr. LT. Nice one for the Bronx Bombers. Star of the show. Five out of twenty-seven. I have no idea what you mean, though. How you? How are players paid for their autos? Like, are, I'm assuming. Are you asking about? I'm on. I'm not even being. Try, I'm not trying to be funny. I'm really asking you. You gotta be more specific. Are you asking me like the actual mechanics of how they get money into their account? Like, it's if that's the question, then it's usually their business managers handle that, and that'll get to the players at that point because uh, they all sign contracts. Are you asking how much? It's a different question. Ozzy Smith, the Adrian Beltre. I honestly don't know what you're asking. I'm assuming you're asking how much they're getting paid. Is that what you're asking? Adrian Bell trade a 150. Ernie Banks, Yohannes Cespedes. Greg Maddox and a Corey Seager. Nice. Don't need you anymore, Corey Seager. We got Charlie Carlson. 33 out of 36. That goes to the Dodgers. Chad with a nice break. And Juan Gon Gonzalez, Jersey and Auto, 37 out of 50. There you go, Rangers. Mark Bear. Ah, I see. Um, that's a good question. It differs for, I think it differs uh, from player to player, depending on what, depending on who they are, you know, what they command on a secondary market, how famous they are, how popular they are. 
Um, I think some players could get paid in a lump sum. Um, some players, I think at Tom Brady level, there is like a, a, a big amount per autograph that they do, which is why you don't see a lot of Tom Brady autographs inside sets. And I, it's usually not percentage of box sales. It's usually not percentage of box sales. Uh, Jackie Robinson for that cut auto, that I don't know because they could, you could source, cut autographs are different because you could source those in many different ways. So if, if someone at Tops, right, had a, had a, a check, an old check of Jackie Robinson in their personal collection, Tops could buy it off that person, you know, for X amount of dollars and that's negotiable. And then they literally cut it out and insert it into that product. They could have gotten it from the estate, the Jackie Robinson estate. There's Chris Sale. If that's the case, I mean, it, it differs for every player. It's not the same for everybody. Chris Sale for the Red Sox. Mark McGuire at 340. But if it was from the estate, uh, my assumption would be that they got they got they didn't just get it. They don't just get things one at a time. There's David Price out of 340. So they probably got not only that cut autograph but some other jack a bunch of other Jackie Robinson stuff too paid to the estate for x amount of price or from some collector that has a bunch of Jackie Robinson stuff so you source it there there's Bautista for the Blue Jays and then they include it into the product Ichiro Zach Granke Lou Gehrig David Wright Starling Marte, Relic, 23 out of 36 for the Pirates. Yeah, everyone has a different deal, though. A lot, a lot of people ask, and I learned this at the National recently, a lot of people ask, like, oh, well, the, the Brewers never have hits. Why come the Brewers don't have hits in this product? Tops hates Brewers. You know, that's actually not the case. A lot of times it's, sometimes athletes just don't want to sign. You know, and there's specific contracts that Tops works out with athletes to get them to sign for a certain amount of products. If they don't get enough, if they don't get brewers to do it, or at a price that they feel is correct, you know, uh, you don't you don't see a lot of brewers there. Nice triple relic: Carlos Gonzalez, Miguel Cabrera, Jose Altuve, twenty three out of twenty seven. Um, why? You, I mean, reason why you don't see Tom Brady in a lot of stuff is that uh, he he uh, I think charges an exorbitant amount per auto. I mean, he can do it by auto because he's Tom Brady. There's a redemption back here. Let's look at this one behind the big hurt first. Kenta Maeda again, jersey and auto. You got the trade whistle, you got another one. Jersey auto, 45 out of 99. So like, for example, uh, ESPN's kid saying Bumgarner doesn't sign a lot. Uh, Mac, yes, we broadcast until uh, 11 o'clock Pacific. I'm going to have some dinner after this and then whatever else you see close on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Nice Kenta Maeda. So Bumgarner, I, I don't know. Maybe he doesn't like signing. Maybe he says he's declined to sign in sets. Maybe he charges a lot for his autos, so he's saved for other products. Hunter Pence, last redemptions. There, there's been a few in this. Triple Threads autograph relic card. Francisco Lindor for the Tribe. Nice finish right here. Jeff with the Tribe, Indians. A little quiet throughout the break, but boom, Francisco Lindor. Let's go, Dodgers. Get in there. Safe. Out. Boo. It's fake news, ump. All right, Francisco Lindor for the Indians. And a quick randomizer. Um, I also saw like a comment earlier about like how there should be no like sticker autos in a big product. The actual mechanics of getting people to sign on card is very difficult. It's very time consuming. So do you want to hold back production of a product because you wanted to get Elijah McGuire's rookie auto on card? You know, and that's another cost too. So it all add, it all adds up. And so that's why you'll end up seeing like those set kind of second tier rookies or not as popular rookies uh, will uh, will end up being sticker autos in a lot of cases. 
All right, so we got Carlos Gonzalez. Actually, oh yeah, Carlos Gonzalez. Cargo will be Rockies. Miguel Cabrera, Tigers, and Astros for Jose Altuve. Let's roll the dice. Five and a one, six times. Name on top, or team on top will get it. One, two, three, four, five, and a one. Six times. After six times, it goes to the Astros. So that triple relic from the World Baseball Classic goes to Carlos and the Astros. There you go, Carlos. 23 out of 27. Nice. So there you go, folks. What a break. Derek Jeter, the captain to 18. Jackie Robinson cut auto one of I did pull one before Todd it was in a panini it was in a panini product I think it was a National Treasures Collegiate or something like that Kenta Maeda train whistle all sorts of great stuff in this what a break ladies and gentlemen thank you very much folks Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com Triple Threads Baseball in the books we'll see you next time jazbeeshobbyland.com